Good morning, Carlsbad. To start off the show, we've been packaged on a very interesting store in the village and its owner. Let's roll the story. In the busy streets of Carlsbad, Lynn Peterson, a local shop owner, makes a living doing what she loves. This is old Ivy Antiques, and I've owned this shop for 23 years. She started this shop at a turning point in her life, and it turned out to be a great decision. I started this shop when I was pregnant with my daughter, and I was looking for sort of a second career and I just loved antiquing. Keeping an antique shop open in the middle of a modernizing city hasn't been easy. And I had to really keep reinventing what we do because the street changed and it was like restaurants and clothing stores and it wasn't just a bunch of antique stores on the street. Even in the midst of a pandemic, Lynn has found a way to meet new people and make connections in a safe way. Besides that, if I kind of take those items and I put them in the shop and then a customer comes in and then we have a conversation. They show me pictures of their house. That's really fun too. I love that. Although this job presents many challenges, this shop owner has found a way to bring in elements of the past in an ever-changing world. Reporting for CHS TV, this is Danica Hewitt and Juliana Proctor. Thank you, Danica and Juliana. Miracosta presentations for graduating seniors are taking place on April 21st and 28th. See School Loop for a link to register. Would you like to join the Rob Machado Foundation Environmental Youth Council? See School Loop for the link to the flyer with more info. Next, we have Sebastian giving us a look into this weekend's weather and what to expect. Sebastian? Good morning, Carlsbad. My name is Sebastian Anderson here on Lightcraft to tell you a little bit about the weather for the upcoming weekend. So today and tomorrow, we have temperatures in the low to mid 60s. And moving into Sunday, we're going to see a high of 75 and a low of 54. Moving into next week, when we're back to school, it's going to be 72 with a low of 52. Air quality and pollution will be good over the weekend, along with visibility. That's all I have for you today, Carlsbad, and I'll send it back to Zach at the desk. Thank you, Sebastian, for the weather. Interested in a career in the military? Virtual military visits will be taking place April 26th through 30th, every day at 2 p.m. See School Loop for more details. ASVAB registration now open. The test will take place on April 21st from 7.30 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. The ASVAB is an aptitude test to help students identify their strengths. It also functions as the military entrance exam. See School Loop for the flyer to sign up. All sports played in the gym and the field will now be live streamed, including tomorrow's basketball game. Link can be found on chstv.com. Now we have McKenna to talk to us on the Magic Window about Disneyland's reopening. What's up Carlsbad? As more and more people are being vaccinated, life is slowly moving towards normalcy. Theme parks are now allowed to be open at 35% capacity. Disneyland and Disney California Adventure will be opening at 15% capacity on April 30th and will only be available for California residents. Masks will be mandatory and there will be social distancing on rides and in lines as well as temperature screenings at entrances. Unfortunately, fast passes, parades, and fireworks will no longer be available, but a majority of the beloved rides, such as Splash and Space Mountain, will still be available. If you're planning on visiting the Magic Kingdom, have fun and stay safe. Zach, back to you. Thank you, McKenna. Get an overview of local community colleges in San Diego. See Flyer on School Loop for signups. Summer school at Carlsbad Sessions now available for pre-registration. See School Loop for link to sign up. California Scholarship Federation application window is extended to this Friday, April 16th at 3 p.m. Please see the National Honor Society's page of the CHS website to submit your application. To take a break in the announcements, we have Holden Andagero to, take, to talk to us about the weather and events this weekend in Carlsbad. My name is Holden. Currently, we are on Armada Drive right behind the flower fields. Now, Livy covered this on Wednesday in her live. However, today we're here to talk about a specific event. First, let's get into the weather. Today, there's going to be a high of 63, and it's going to become sunny around noonish, so be sure to look for that. The same applies for tomorrow. However, on Sunday, look for a high of 75, sunny all day. Now, if you don't want, if you, excuse me, if you don't want to go to the beach, another great option is to come to the event here at the flower fields. Canon is hosting photography day here at the flower fields, and actually, uh, they're going to be loaning out cameras to you, your family, your friends, anyone, and you get to come out here and you get to take pictures, um, you know, wide angle, close up, whatever you want. That's all I have for you today, Carlsbad. Now I'm going to send it back to the anchors at the desk. Thank you, Holden. 
Uh, so Danica, this was your first time anchoring. How did you feel? It was actually really fun and a lot less stressful than I thought it was going to be. That's good. You did well. Thank all you. right, Carlsbad, that's all we have for you today. Thanks for tuning in. See ya. Thank you for watching our live broadcast today. Remember that you could follow us on social media and view our past broadcasts on chstv.com. Thank you, and we'll see you next time.